Hey, what's going on? You know who it is. You know what it is. All right, you guys. Um, of course, you guys knew I was going to talk about this. This, you know, just chill. I got it. I got it. Okay. Um, I just want to talk about, <laughs> you know, uh, Tom Scott. Yeah, I know his name is uh, is Tim, but you know where I'm going with this. You know I'm being sarcastic. You know, but at the end of the day, this is why I constantly tell you guys, as far as politicians go, whether they po Republican or Democrat, we can't trust politicians because for uh, Tom Scott to sit up there and say that there's no racism in America when they're trying to specifically pass laws that benefit Asians, Americans, you know, calling it, a, a, you know, Asian hate crimes, you know, bills. Well, doesn't hate mean you know, a form of racism, basically a hate crime is a, a crime committed against a person just because you hate their ethnicity. So that's a contradiction within itself. Okay. Well then don't pass no laws that specifically are targeted to protect Asian Americans, even though they, you know, this Asian hate crime stuff has been completely blown out of proportion. And actually it's been more of a distraction of what's really going on with us and to a certain degree it's starting to die down to me that shit then got debunked on several occasions but you know like i said to the asians that stood up and said you know what this is bullshit black people are not attacking us you know it, it's, it's a lie i appreciate that real talk but this video isn't about them this is about you know Tim Tim Scott telling the bold faced lot that there's no racism in America. Oh really? Really? Well, how come people have sued jobs and won money for racial discrimination? Okay. Uh how come people have got fired from jobs for making remarks about a person's race? Like I said, the contradiction, the contradiction in that man's speech is just mind-boggling. I don't even see how that dude can sit up there and tell a bold-faced lie and say, oh, well, the Democrats are race-baiting. Well, the Democrats are just as big a racist as the Republicans, and I'm going to talk about that in the next video. But Tom Scott, you know, at the end of the day, he just he just proved why you can't take politicians seriously that they're all liars and they're all full of shit when it's all said and done. You know, I don't even see how he can sit up there with a straight face and say that. I don't even think I don't even think racists that know they're racist was buying what he was selling. And he was just trying to sell bullshit. That's all he was doing. What you living proof there's no racism when People, like I said, get called out their name on a regular basis and disrespected and harmed. I'm just, I'm just laughing because, like I said, it's, it's just, it's just, it's just crazy that people just really try to insult you on television. They in particularly try to insult black people's intelligence. Now, if anybody come on my channel trying to repeat what this man say and they agree with him, you're going to get blocked. Because he told a bold-faced lie. Tim, or whatever the fuck his name is, is a liar. Tom Scott, whatever. Dude is full of crap. Okay? He really is. It just It's just mind-boggling how you get these people that think they can uh, bring up these display niggas and think we supposed to believe them because they say so. Just like they've been trying to tally up all these display niggas about... You know, getting the jab. So, I mean, come on, man. I just wish they would just, I just wish they would cut the shit. I wish they would stop trying to insult black people's intelligence because we passed the point to where we believe anything somebody say just because they black. Them days is long over. The display nigga days is long, long over. We don't pay attention to them. Now, it's one particular person that I am going to talk about in the next video. And it's going to be more towards this person's followers than the people that support them. Because y'all finna get called out on your, 
your blatant hypocrisy and double standards. <laughs> but at the end of the day, you know, Tim Scott is full of shit. He knows it and the Republican Party knows it. That shit don't work. Who you trying to convince that there ain't no racism? How the fuck you gonna sit up there and say something like that that you know is a lie? When we just, when we clearly have seen numerous cases where black men and black women were taken out by either law enforcement or somebody that, you know, had what you would call, you, you, you know, uh, fair skin or palm colored or, you know, um, uh, you know, non melon, melanin. So yeah, please cut the shit. You're not fooling nobody. You just making a fool out of yourself and you are presenting yourself as a liar and you can't tell me different. And if anybody come on here trying to co-sign what that handkerchief head said, then you just automatically blocked. I'm not going back and forth with you. But anyway, middle finger to Tom Scott. Just your boy, Town Biz. I'm out.